thanks for watching. In this part, you will learn how to use the UR 2000 UH Afridus demo and how to set the reader's parameters. So, firstly, insert the USB cable into the PCs. So, you will hear the beep, and means that it's connected to the PCs. So, just open the software and, e and go to a demo and go to Delphi. Okay, go to readers, go inside to folders, and find this one. These applications, just to double click and in. Okay, if you have successfully installed the drivers as part one, and you were just get directly uh, open the COM port and go OK. So the reader parameters are show in this way so and the second part this part this part others readers parameters you can set the reader parameter here so um, so the most important parameter is the power and the UHF readers power can set from 0 dB to 30 dB uh, the maximum the power the longer the, the read, read distance but UR2000 alpha reader is a desktop short range UHF reader so uh, suggest you still set as default 30 because you set to zero and the read distance is very short and even if you set as 30 the read distance can not exceeded 20 centimeters so please take, pay attention and then the frequency range uh, you can you can say chinese us korean eu band here so normally we uh, we set U, us band and set parameters and get information and you will update the information here the second tab here is the reader writers functions and the third part is uh is another type of UHF alpha text and this text are uh this tag is based on <coughs> ISO one uh, one eight zero 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 uh six B platcos and the typical chip is an X speed H U code HSL chip and this is very real so I uh, just need to use this so we will not use this part and if you have some uh, 6B card and you can just use this uh, part okay so from this part you will learn how to uh, set a car readers parameters so that's very simple and that's to, in that part we we'll learn, we we'll teach you how to uh, use the read and write functions here. EPC G two test test. Okay, thanks for watching.